and welcome to 5 Minutes of Culture, and today we'll be talking about Djibouti cuisine. Djibouti, officially the Republic of Djibouti, was, is a country located in the Horn of Africa. It's bordered by Eritrea in the north, Ethiopia and the west and the south, and Som Somalia to the southeast, and Yemen to the northeast. Its capital is Djibouti, and the con it's on the continent of Africa, and its official languages are French and Arabic. Djibouti cuisine consists of a, a mixture of Somali, Ethiopian, Yemenian, and French cuisine. Because the French actually colonized this and was Djibouti, and it was only gaining independence about 30 years ago. And so, several popular dishes feature seafood and meat since they are close to the sea. Banana fritters, which we'll be making today, are one of the most popular dishes because of the availability of the ingredients. But bananas are not grown in Djibouti because of the hot climate. So, they are exported from Ethiopia. So, the ingredients to make banana fritters will be three well-ripened well bananas, four, two ounces of wheat flour, an ounce of sugar dissolved in, four t in two tablespoons of water, a teaspoon of nutmeg, and that's it. And our tools are going to be this to measure one t a tablespoon, a knife, a bowl to mix everything in, this bowl for, wa for the water and the salt, and the measuring cup to mash the bananas. And potentially a paper towel if things get messy. So, let's get started. First thing we're gonna do is mash the ripened bananas. So, I got the bananas, I put them in, and then I will mash them to make more like a pulp and put them into the big bowl. Alright, so we've mashed the bananas into more of a pulp, and now we're going to put it in the big bowl. Make sure to get every bit of it in there, as well as you can. Now, we're going to add four tablespoons of wheat flour. One. Two. dissolve the sugar in two tablespoons of water. All right, now we'll need a half a teaspoon of nutmeg. Close enough. And then our so our sugar has dissolved. We'll pour that in. All right, and then I'll mix All it right. well. We've mixed, and it looks a lot like pancake batter. So 
Now we're going to pour it onto a oil frying pan and just like a pancake. So, hope I don't burn myself. Might look like a weird looking pancake, but all right. So, that's going to be what our pancakes look like, apparently. So, we'll just wait for it to cook on one side and flip it over when it's golden brown. Alright, I think they're ready to flip over. Alright. Now it's time to eat All them. All right, time to eat it. That's pretty good. Thanks for watching.